Hey everybody, hey, I just video tutorial to kind of explain uh, briefly what Cody actually is and what it actually does. Um, you can check on here, you can kind of see um, there are a few different categories that it has. You have programs, let me go back a little bit. You have programs, you got music videos, pictures, weather. Um, the one that everybody most wants to know about is the video aspect of it. Um, and I'll kind of give you a rundown on that right quick. I'm going to go over to your video add-ons. Video add-ons is basically, in my mind, what amounts to uh, channels. So if you can kind of equate it to your TV, um, you have different channels here some of the main channels that you have or video add-ons that you have people use widely is uh, one channel uh, two movies evolved and we'll scroll down to let's see click that's another one um give me a second and you got your food network um, Genesis is another popular one. Um, we'll go down to Phoenix, which was on the home page. We'll just go back to that and I'll show you that. We'll click out of here. Phoenix, Ice Films, Project TV. Um, each one of these has its own um, kind of a specialty. Um, and just briefly, I'll show you with Genesis. Let's click that one. Genesis is basically your home for movies and TV shows. If we were to go to, let me go ahead and sort this. Get the big listing here. Let's say you go to movies. Within your movie section, you have your different genres you can sort by genre language most popular uh, what people are watching currently uh, you can search, search it by the years what's popular in theaters now uh, HD some of the latest movies and then you can also have movies or that you can select by putting in your favorites um, people want to know you know basically well you know where are all these movies coming from things of that nature um, the best that I can tell you or the best way to describe it you can consider this kind of a, a search engine maybe or something that basically aggregates movies that are shared on various streaming sites over the internet um, let's say for instance Pitch Perfect 2 currently in theaters um, and we select that it's going to give us probably 30 different places online that this movie is currently being streamed and will give you uh, basically like a quality rating of what that movie is and the size of the actual file that's being streamed so I mean, as you can see I'm scrolling here here what you got so far we're at what 138 so 138 sites or links should I say of places where this file is currently being shared so and they give you this enormous listing because at any given time these links could be disabled and or non-working um you can start with the first one let's see if that actually plays so we're going to click that one it comes up pretty instant <laughs> I'm going to turn the volume down on that. But as you see, that, that one worked. That one came up pretty instant. And as you can see, the quality of it is pretty good, to say the least. So, um, we'll just stop this and come out of it. Um, let's try home. I know home works. So anyway, they give you those many links because, hey, they're not guaranteed that they're all going to work. So if one doesn't work, just move to the next one. Um, 
home. We'll pick the first one again. See how that looks. See if it works. Pops up. Boom. Working. Cowering, running, and pulling a skedaddle, we are safe from our enemy, the Gorg. All right, so we'll come out of that. As you see, that's working. So those are just a couple um, just offhand that we can see that are actually working. Um, let's go to TV shows. You know, people people have, uh, I myself have Hulu and uh, Netflix. But honestly, this could almost pretty much replace those. I mean, there are some specialized things that are on um, Netflix and Hulu that you might not be able to find at, at times on here. But from what I've seen, it's a pretty good, it's a pretty good uh, place to find all those kind of shows. And and honestly, it could, you could probably end up replacing Hulu and or Netflix with. I mean, Dare, Daredevil. That's a Netflix only thing, I believe. I've watched this on here. Quality's good, um, and the sources are pretty good in terms of them actually working when you actually click on them. Netflix, as you see it. So I'll just skip to actual viewing so as you can see the, the quality of this is just as good as you would find it probably on Netflix what about this asshole take care of him like we were told no witnessing <laughs> All right, so we'll come out of that so that's just one thing um, another source that that is available um, let's go to Phoenix Phoenix is good for if you like live sports events, sports channels, things of that nature, you can find those here. And wait for it to load up. And go to Phoenix TV. And let's go to sports. Uh, live game and events. So, we got baseball. Let's go to baseball. It's baseball season. You'll find something here. Uh, Cubs Nationals. What time? It's 4 4 5. I don't know what time it is, wherever it's being played at. But these are good for playing, like finding like live in game or live real time in game. Uh, shows that are going on right now still waiting for the stream to pick up if it's available like I said I'm not even sure what time zone these are in I mean Nationals the East Coast Cubs is Central so I don't know where that game was actually being played at so that game didn't load so I'm going to try again and maybe it started earlier so let's try a Brewers Twins uh, game See if that actually starts. Yeah, I mean the quality is not great, but hey, you're talking about a video stream that's not HD, and you're not paying for it. So that that one actually did load. It's like there is a little buffering sometimes. I think there's a fix for the buffering issue, but I haven't actually got into it and tried it yet. But, but as you can see, yeah, it does actually play. So sometimes it's hit and miss in terms of what's playing, um, when it's actually, when the game's scheduled. And like I said, I'm not sure what they based the time settings off of um, Central or Eastern or what, but just wanted to let you know that it actually played. So we're gonna stop this stream and move to something else. Um, back out of this and go back to your video add-ons and or channels 
and I'll show you like CBS Live. There's a CBS Live TV stream that you can watch for like your more like national news. You're not going to get like your local news station, but you'll get like national stuff. Like here's the live. Live is like double HD as far as I'm concerned. It's really good. Oh, 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 can I? Not sure exactly what this live show is on CBS, but nonetheless, it is live. Um, another live stream that we got is something called uh, USA TV Now. Let me try to show you what that is. Let's scroll down to it. Now you have to have an account with them, um, and and, and the free, there's a free accounts would give you basically the your most uh, the network stations ABC, CBS, CW, CW Fox, NBC, PBS. I'm not sure what my nine is. But I think it's like maybe PBS or something. I don't know. I've never really watched it, but this is free. You can sign up for that. And you can add that in. When I set up a Fire Stick or set up a Android streaming TV box, I already had that pre-configured, so you don't have to do anything. Um, but yeah, this is a live stream from, I guess it was ABC that I clicked on. We come back out. Let's go to CBS PGA Golf Tour. What's going on with that? This is live as well. So I mean, quality's okay. Like I said, this is free live streaming of your network stations. Feed back down. This will get all the way back to the middle of the green. Very well played. Go, go ahead and stop that. But yeah, this is just a quick rendition or rundown of what Cody actually is. I mean, you can if you get one of my uh, modded uh, Amazon Fire TV Six or the streaming box, all of these channels that you see here or add-ons are already pre-configured if they require passwords if I can get them set up I already have it set up for you so you don't have to worry about that um, really you get one you can just kind of play around with it but I mean if, if you pay the price of what I charge it's well worth it if you don't do anything